Okay. So, um... <laughs> this is what I'm doing. I'm playing yet another horror game. Oh my god! A gay legend! Okay, fuck. I can't- oh. I can't be doing this this early in the fucking video. Oh, spooky kids. Oh my god, is this an abortion commercial? Is it bringing back memories? Why the fuck is this blasting in my fucking headphones? Okay, bitch. Okay, it literally sounds like static. But like, we're gonna have to get over that. <sighs> Bitch, I'm turning the brightness up. I don't give a fuck. I'm not playing this game where I literally like feel like I need a flashlight in real life. I should stop touching the mic. Okay, let's get playing. I play I paid thirteen dollars for this. Oh <laughs> I'm playing it currently in a dark room with headphones on. And your sanity. What? Bro, I swear something just growled in my room. In my heart and I oh yeah, no, we're playing with the lights on. <laughs> as soon as I start playing fucking horror games, scary shit always starts happening. Settings. Does this one have fucking subtitles? What? Oh, enable subtitles. Wow, I'm fucking blind. Okay. Mr. Bear. He dead. I haven't seen Mr. Bear, Callum. Ew. Ew. Oh my god. Oh, <gasps> thick. <laughs> Look at her ass. Oh my god. Stay in the car. Why the fuck are you leaving your kid? Look at her awful parking job. Oh my god. Can anyone do their fucking job right? Okay, how is the line that defined in this pile of leaves that I didn't even care to, like, vaguely clean up? Ew, also the controls are, like, so bad. I'm sorry, not the controls, just, like, the feel. The vibe. This game is not vibin'. One out of ten. Attention, patrons. The park is now closed. Please make your way to the car park at your earliest convenience. Before you prepare the park to shut down. Am I supposed to interact with something? Yeah, I couldn't interact with my fucking child, let alone... Anything else in this... Terrible ass game. Oh my god. Can I go through the trash? Oh, so it's locked? Dickweed, let me in! Ew, that was such a bad transition. What? 
She's so... Lorraine. She's a Lorraine. slim, thick legend. Don't blame yourself, Lorraine. People lose things all the time. What? Take a deep breath. Think about the last place you saw. <laughs> hey, stop. I think your boy just ran into the park. I'll unlock the gates for you. How the fuck did he get in? But my whole grown-ass body couldn't get in there. He's calling me, oh my god. Oh my god. I did not ask to FaceTime you. Like, I don't know what gave you the intention. I'm not playing anymore, Callum. Over here. What is this about? One. Well, purchased on the Solomon Island. Blah, blah, blah. Anyone else hear the whispering? Kylum, Kylum, Kylum. Callum? Over here. Oh, now he sounds like he's dying. Well, looks like it's time. Mommy needs to see you, Callum. Isn't that him over there? I can't see. This witch needs to get glasses. Jesus Christ. She has a large Callum? fucking astigmatism in the are. I need to see you, Callum. Mommy, what? Where are you, you little fuck? Stop, Callum. Where is he? <laughs> Callum? Where'd you go? Can you just be like this the entire... Come on, Callum. Stop playing. You know mommy has her seizures every now and again. Where are you? Callum! Callum! Callum, where are you? Her mood just, like, changes, too. She got bipolar disease. Where did you go? Where did you go? Stop! Callum! Kick me, mommy! Kick me, mommy? Mommy needs to see you, Callum. Catch me. Come out, sweetie. This way, mommy. Bitch, what? Another accident. This place. What? Um. Read the note. Despite the constants. Fuck. Can I take the teddy bear that looks low-key cute? No, I cannot. Well, a man will murder in that truck. Bang.
How am I not allowed on? Wait, Callum. Cal oh, I was about to say, Callum got fucking tired of me. <laughs> Wait, what? What did it want me to do? Why the fuck can't I walk? Oh, I remember this. Callum? Read. As if that wasn't fucking readable. Um. One, he looks terrified. Two, I look like I'm having an orgasm. But like, in a horror movie? And three, is there something creepy in the background? Mommy needs to see you, Callum. Treachery hides in thoughts. Treachery that lashes like a whip <laughs> and scars our insides. <laughs> the first time I saw Callum, my thoughts betrayed me. I wanted to fuck my child. I looked child. down at this wrinkled, red, bawling thing, and I thought, is that it? <laughs> we build our world from expectations, and the world that I had built for Callum is no different. He was so real, so there, and so far from my expectations. And they shattered, and as they fell in pieces, that one treacherous thought became a new foundation. All of the love that we shared, all of the warmth and goodness that followed, built on a single traitorous thought. Isn't that like... I don't know. <laughs> Fuck me in the ass, dude. I wasn't. Oh my god. Oh. Callum, come back here right now. Fuck you, kid. Callum. Callum. Mommy got jump scared. Constant crashes in 80s music. Guess it floats someone's boat. Oh, God. This one was also in the channel. Examine device. Play the 80s music. <laughs> Her eyes are gone, bruh. Learn about shock therapy? <gasps> she was a lesbian. Oh. Oh my god. I hate playing horror games. Did I ever say that? I fucking mean it. I hate playing horror games so much. <gasps> I am literally such a fucking scaredy cat. Eat a dick. Fuck you. Fuck your kids. Fuck you and your family. Why? Examine accident report. Shit, I didn't read it. Just 
just stand there, darling. Okay, now can I read the accident report? No, I cannot. Apparently, this is the way. Alan, why did you go? This motherfucker says. This way, mommy! Like, shut the fuck up. Let me read it. I meant to click. <sighs> fuck. Can I just deviate? Mommy is coming, Callum! Did he go this way? I don't like it, I don't like it, I don't like it, I don't like the sounds, I don't like the sounds. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you. Mommy is coming, Kelm. Say it again for the people in back. Okay, I'm going this way. The other way was literally in a... <laughs> I don't want to go this way. I mean, I don't want to go the other way. <laughs> fuck you, and fuck your family too. <laughs> I swear to fucking god, it, we're literally... Oh, still outside, okay, never mind. I thought we were going into like a cave or something, but... <laughs> Sorry guys, false alarm. Okay, yep. Hello. It's a matter of public record that I am a failure as a mother. <laughs> Once, when Callum was very small, I left him asleep in the car while I ran an errand. Don't even remember what it was. When I came back, the sheriff was standing next to the car, watching my boy through the window. I didn't like what I saw in his eyes. Judgment. <laughs> he wrote me the ticket without saying a word. Just the scratch scratch of his pen on the notepad. When he gave it to me, our eyes met. And that's what I found. I know what you're going through. My daughter, Helen, she just gets some help. Help was a bolt of lightning. Help was a thousand volts surging through my veins. Help is agony. I'd rather die. I wanted to scream. I'd rather you pulled your gun and shot me. But instead, my mouth said, Yes, Sheriff. Yeah, Daddy. Nope. That part's getting cut out. I guess I'll read the fucking page. Mm. Can someone beat me over the head with a fucking lead pipe? Oh my god, the gate's open. Oh my god, I'm literally so fucking cold. Can we go on the Ferris wheel? I feel like we are going to be able to go on the ferris wheel and then die on the ferris wheel and I'm hoping that we die on the ferris wheel oh my god come on bitch I want to get on, come on bitch I want to get on Wait, I can ride the Ferris wheel? Oh! I probably could have rode the other ride now that I'm thinking about it. I don't like this. Fall, fall, fall. People come into your life for a reason. Dad used to say that before Mom ran off. After that, he mostly just drank. Things were different for Don and I. When we met, I was sweeping the floor at Susie's diner. He came in with some workers, but he didn't try to flirt or cop a feel like the others. He just ordered a coffee and sat there, watching me. 
When my shift was over, he offered to walk me home. I don't know how to describe that walk. We talked and laughed and eventually kissed. It felt like love. It felt like a fairy tale. I can't tell you if Calm was made that night or one of the ones that followed. I think it has to be that night. That one perfect night. Don and I moved in together, but then, well, he died. <laughs> According to the supervisor, his safety harness failed when he was working on the top of the Ferris wheel. Don was there one moment, and then gone. Sometimes people leave your life for no reason. I was three months pregnant with Callum. Fairy tale fucking over. I don't like this. Someone's gonna be right there. Okay, I am able to pause it. Well, at least I wasn't scared <laughs> when I saw that fucker. Oh. Oh. Oh, we're just going to ignore that. Oh, we're just going to ignore that. Ooh. I fucking hate this game. Oh my god, I Stay hate where it. You are. He's not responding anymore. Um, uh, yeah, bitch, that's a crying kid. Um, Callum, tell mommy where you are. No, no, bro, it's a fucking baby. Am I supposed to go up there? Ew, who is ripping ass? Where are you, Callum? Oh my god. Callum? Callum? He's literally a crying baby. Bruh, he's he's a fucking infant. Mommy is coming, Callum. Oh my god. Mommy is coming, Callum. Where Ooh. are you, Callum? Now I'm going backwards. Yeah, I'm going backwards. Um, child. <gasps> Anyways, where is my baby? Why is that one red? Stay where you are. Alan, where did you go? Bro, I lost my kid. Alan, where did you go? 
Oh my god, am I fucking stuck in another one of these games? Oh my god, I feel like I would literally walk on the fucking child. Hearing her voice is now fucking aggravating me. Is that a man? Or a woman? Neither. Alan, where did you go? Where the fuck? Mommy is coming, Helm. Nope. Where did you go? Nope. Stop hiding, Callum. Where are you, Callum? A lot of people idolize their children. You hear them talking about their kids and just the way they talk. Their fucking voices make me want to vomit. <laughs> <laughs> My angel likes to read, and little Johnny is so good on the piano. Fuck those people! You give up nine months of your life carrying them, you traumatize yourself giving birth to them, and then you spend the rest of your life as their slave. Wiping asses, mopping a piss, feeding them, little life-sucking monsters who take and take and take until... <sighs> we all go insane. Any parent who pretends otherwise is just dishonest. That's called choice supportive bias. I am honest. Callum really grinds my gears, and he owes me everything. Everything! It served the little fuck right if I just abandoned him. Whoop. Stay where you are! Nope. He whispered at that time. Nope. No, 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 sir. Where are you? Callum? Don't be afraid. Where are you, Callum? Stay where you are. No, no, no. <laughs> Guys, dead ass. I am so fucking afraid right now. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Teaching my grandma TikTok challenges. Oh my god. <gasps> this is quite possibly the worst thing I could do at like 9pm. I'm a YouTuber. Oh my god. Oh, shit. <laughs> Game over! Respond to that one, you little fuck. Like the fuck? We can dead ass just write it. Oh hi, sir. What do you want? We need to talk about Callum. What do you mean? 
What have you done to him? I? That's insulting. You and your boy are everything that this place doesn't want. The antithesis. Oh, is he behind me? Where is Callum? The poor child. He tried so hard to do what he was taught. He even left you a trail of breadcrumbs. But the park is just so hungry. Tell me where my son is. Oh, yeah, that is him. Which has it now? Oh, oh! <laughs> ending here I'm afraid just just leave me alone fool you always were that's on period what are those what <laughs> what <laughs> Wait, I didn't read it. Gravity? Oh, fuck. I'm never looking in the right direction. Something. Can you taste your tongue? Taste your hands? Hi. <laughs> you just killed the kid. Come on. Well, now he's not as scary. As long as he doesn't jump scare me. And as long as I am just as clueless as I was writing this. Callum. Oh. I can help you, Callum. Callum, where are you? Huh. Well, Callum's dead. Bye. Come back. Callum? Callum? I like how it tells you where to go. I'm not falling for this shit again. The witch awaits. I'm not playing anymore, Callum. <laughs> this isn't a game, Callum. Bitch. This isn't Hansel and Gretel. Callum? Callum? Callum has bruises on his arms, finger marks. Someone has been hurting him. I've asked him, demanded really, to know where he got the marks. But he doesn't want to answer me. Something has scared him into silence. He doesn't dare talk. He's been changing too. Something sinister lurks in the darkness behind his eyes. I catch him staring at me at odd moments. In the night, he tosses and turns and cries out words that I cannot understand. When I try to soothe him, he snaps and bites at my fingers. <laughs> I think he wants to talk to me. I think he wants to tell me. They are watching him every minute of every day. They are whispering to him in his sleep, changing him. They are taking my baby away from me. <laughs> I can't save him. And there will be pain. But I love him, and in the end, he will understand why. Callum, where are you? Don't let him take me. Don't take me? I thought he said, don't let them take me. The whole town was shocked by that one. Never found out who did it. Yesterday evening, I'm going to get jump scared. I'm going to get jump scared. Visitors to Atlantic Island Park were shocked and horrified by the discovery of a dismembered corpse behind the cotton candy stand. According to the local authorities, the corpse has yet to be identified. However, they have confirmed that the remains appear to be those of a child. The corpse was discovered by a group of teenagers from Innsmouth Academy who noticed a pair of ravens tugging at something just out of sight behind the shack. Nathaniel Winter, the owner of the park, nope, yeah, the park, has released the following statement. It is a true tragedy when something list this, when something list this, okay, now they're triggering my lisp. 
especially in a place that was designed to bring forth happiness and joy. The staff of it... Uh, fuck me. Offer their condolences to the family and friends of the victim, and will cooperate fully with authorities to bring this case to rest. <gasps> I want a teddy bear. I... Oh my god. Apparently... Fuck you, fuck. Fuck you. I'm not playing anymore, Callum. Don't want to take me. Oh my god. Oh, the bread crumbs. Ass wipe. I can help you, Callum. I don't like it. I don't like the child laughing. I feel like that's the scariest thing. Cause like I hate kids. Fuck, wait. Callum! Callum! Mm. What are you of? This pussy. Callum, that's a body. Oh bastard. I did this to him. Huh! <gasps> I didn't fucking ask you. <laughs> You're scared, motherfucker. What about me? I just got, I just got jump scared by an overrated furry. This isn't a game, Callum. Callum. <laughs> Fuck you. Fuck you. Yep, take the pills. Kill me. These are mine. These, these, these are mine. Fucking stupid. Of course they're gonna recreate the hospital scene. She got an abortion. We all get it. He was a failed abortion. Oh. His daughter is hot. Fuck gravity. Let's say, say no to gravity? All that you love will be carried away. 1980s. Are you better off than you were four years ago? Fear the boogeyman. Stop picking your nose then. Uh huh. I can't read that. Oh no, I'm supposed to walk. Your mother. <sighs> oh, is that him? I can't really see that one. What? Oh, he wants me to go this way. Into the table. What is that? I mean whack, but okay. Oh. Don't touch me. Forgive me, Calm. Tell him, you cock nugget. Get back. Pickled puns? No, I, can't, I really can't read. Tell him, I'm sorry. Ooh, we love a little bit of auto tune. Don't let the witch put me in the oven. Why, Callum? You looking like a snack. Oh my god, 
god, did it kill yourself? Oh my god. It really does suck. Oh. We're still alive. And we still have an astigmatism. <sighs> okay, apparently we're just supposed to continue. The arc is a collage of contradictions all of its own. Excuse me? Millions of people die every year in car crashes. And the park has little cars designed specifically to simulate that action. Oh. Here the children scream with joy. In the sideshow alley, you can walk away with 15 cents worth of mass-produced Chinese teddy bears while a grinning carny pockets your hard-earned five dollars. And what secrets lie beneath the sullen walls of the lake? Sorry, wait. I do crack. I'm gonna put my blankie on. So I can be... scared. But with a blanket on. Okay, apparently I can't toggle the flashlight. You're a whore, mommy! Atlantic? Nope. Was this supposed to be like a haunted house? <gasps> I feel like it was. Nope. I feel like this was meant to be a haunted house. Because there's no way. Did you see what happened? I didn't. I don't. I feel like. I feel like I'm gonna have to run away from something. And that is not what I'm fucking here to do. Dead ass. It's so fucking dark. Oh my god. Hi sisters, and welcome back to my vlog! <coughs> oh my god, just... He's back here, isn't he? I'm lit, la I'm lit, blah, blah, blah. I'm having a strong. Okay, that one kind of missed me. No time. Okay.
Can I just follow him? He doesn't seem like that scary of a villain. Sent me home with a handful of breadcrumbs. Home bit a sweet home. I barely recognized it. Where there had been color and light, there were shadows and regrets. Where there had been warmth, there was a bone deep coldness that never went away. I tried my hardest to keep the ghosts at bay. Don, watching from the dusty corners while I tried to teach his son to read. My father, coldly assessing me and finding me lacking. I devoted myself to Callum, did the things that they told me. It will get better, they said. Every day will be a little better than the last. I'm in the woods now. Lost and afraid. Things never got any better. Oh my god. No cap. Why is it so quiet? Yeah, no one cares. I'm not reading. Thank you. Asshole. Okay, we'll just keep going down, I guess. Oh, yeah. Stories are told again and again, and from their shape we build our understanding of the world. Two children are led into the woods. They are lost for a time, but then are captured by an old witch. The child goes missing in Atlantic Island Park. He wanders lost for a time, before finding his way into the mouth of an old witch. In the oldest version of the story, the mother and the witch were the same person. I never wanted to be the witch, but I am, aren't I? Oh my god, that's the one book that my son read. It must be a sign. Look at what, yourself? <gasps> So the story is this bitch is on crack. Kill him. Kill him. Kill him. Kill him. Kill him. Ooh, kill him. Ooh, kill him. <gasps> oh, he's dead. He's dead. He's dead. Dead, dead, dead. Boom, boom, boom. Slim, thick queen. Everybody see the red eyes in the background. Hey, what the fuck is he wearing? Is that Zoidberg? He's kind of cute, though. No cap. Kind of cute. He's also a skinny legend. Why not? Honestly. Um. Hey. You just kill your kid? Killed a book. 
Oh. And it was all about her nose the entire time. That's why I zoomed in on that. Game over? Killed her good. Game over. No need for Callum. We could just leave the park. Bye, Callum. Hey, Lorraine. Lorraine. Don't blame yourself, Lorraine. People lose things all the time. So tell me, why'd you bring a fucking bug into the office? Take a deep breath and think about the last place you saw your son. Dead. On a table. I killed him. Period. Told that little fucker who was on sight. What do you mean my battery's running low? Oh! Oh my god. <laughs> Well, first off, is the game over? It is! Also, the thing I plugged it into was off. I had my fucking computer plugged into an awful... Oh my god. Oh my god. Wait, is that literally it? Wait, what? That's it? That shit was short. Fifth I'm sorry, thirteen dollars for that. <laughs> Wait, what do you mean continue? What will it load me into? I swear to god, if it loads me into the very beginning... Mm-mm. <laughs> no, no, no. Not today. Oh my god. We already did this. Right? Stories are told again and again, and from their shape we build our understanding of the world. Two children are led into the woods. They are lost for a time, but then are captured by an old witch. The child goes missing in Atlantic Island Park. He wanders lost for a time, before finding his way into the mouth of an old witch. In the oldest version of this story, the mother and the witch were the same person. I never wanted to be the witch. But I am, aren't I? Okay, anyway, yeah, it's the same fucking ending. Cool, really, really cool game. I really liked it. Um, yeah, so... That's the game. <laughs> this minute? Nope. Let me try that again. This video is probably five minutes long. So you know what I'm gonna do? Um... Look at- I'm a skinny legend. Not in real life, of course. Okay. Well, guys, <laughs> that's the end of the game. Um, wait, it would be better if I did it on here. Well, guys, that's the end of the game. That was fucking awful. I don't remember being funny throughout most of it. So this 
video was probably like five minutes long, but who gives a fuck? It, the shorter it is, the more likely people are to watch. So that's my logic. That should be yours too. <laughs> Bye, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to like, subscribe, and fuck me for more of my content. <laughs> Bye.